Did your mom pack your lunch? <laughs> of course not. Do you know how much it costs to pack a tuna fish sandwich and dry ice and overnight it from Texas? <laughs> oh, I do, and my mother says it's too expensive. I like tuna fish. D do you want it? I'll sell it to you for $5,000. How's the fundraising going? Oh, that depends. Raj, was that a yes? No. It's going badly. How much have you raised? Well, with my Kickstarter campaign, selling my collectibles, and the money in my bank account, about $65,000. Wow, that's a lot. Well, yeah, not enough. It's so frustrating that science should be held hostage to the almighty dollar. Don't give up. You'll find that money somewhere. You really think so? No, but it's good that he has a hobby. <laughs> you ever thought of going to Vegas? Can you be more specific? Las Vegas? <laughs> oh, you mean gambling. Oh, well, that's not the worst idea. Um, it is the worst idea. And I'm including the year that Raj wore nothing but track suits. <laughs> Ordinary people can't beat a casino, but mathematicians and scientists, they do it all the time. Yeah, a group of students from MIT took Las Vegas for millions, and that's MIT. Howard went there. <laughs> Come on, Sheldon, I'll give you a ride out to the desert right now. No one is going to Vegas. No, we weren't going to make it to Vegas. <laughs> Anyone seen Sheldon? Last time I saw Sheldon was this morning. Careful, don't say his name a third time. You don't think he actually went to Las Vegas, do you? Barbara! This is it. Is everything okay, sir? Oh, it's better than okay. I am a physicist, and I've been observing this wheel for hours and running a chi-square analysis, which is how I know that the ball is far more likely to land on 32, 17, or 5. So if you could hold off on replacing this wheel, I'd like to make several large bets. Well, good for you. Pelican. What's Pelican? Sir, would you come with us? Oh, no, no, I have to place my bet first. This is for science. 17 black. No! 